Hey, it's Kristen at Mrs. Jerry's and we are at my grandma's house and we are going to be making um, lefsa today and we're going to use Mrs. Jerry's premium mashed potatoes and the Lynn's lefsa recipe that um, is in our serving suggestions. <coughs> so all the things you need, we have the lefsa grill, we have turning sticks, we have our rolling pin with a sock on it and our pastry cloth for rolling out the lefsa and we have our mashed potatoes here all measured out we're going to do a double batch so there's eight cups which is about a five pound bag um, so we're going to mix it up next so we're just mixing in the flour um, it will be four cups of flour um, to eight cups of mashed potatoes so we're using our hands to make the dough so this was just one cup so we'll keep adding and yeah make some dough we need a bigger bowl <laughs> just wait so we might have underestimated the size we needed for our bowl, so we transferred to the big yellow bowl. So this is the fourth cup of flour. So we're adding in the sugar and the vegetable oil. And then after this, we will check and see how sticky um, the dough is and see if we need to add any more flour. Do we need to add more flour? Nope, I think it's perfect, Kristen. <laughs> How many years have you been making lefsa? I have been making lefsa for about 50 years. She's the expert. So we, we started with a ball that's a little bit bigger than a golf ball, and we're rolling it out. The key is to have a lot of flour on your pastry cloth and on the rolling pin, so you can get it rolled out as flat as you can. Um, that's the key, so it's nice and tender, and it grills fast. Rolling it onto the turning stick and rolling it onto the grill. Just like that. And our grill is pretty much as hot as it can go. And you can see it's steaming and it will start to get a little bubbly. Check it, not quite yet. There you can start to see it's getting a little browner. So we'll turn it and roll it off. Then we'll just wait for the other side to start getting brown too and then we'll take it off and put it between our towels to keep it tender as it cools. So we just finished uh, making all of our lefsa. So um, with what I told you, it made about 40 pieces. Um, our pieces are a little bit bigger, so you could get a lot more out if you made them smaller. So we'll let them cool um, wrapped up in the towels because it keeps the moisture in. And we will um, get to enjoy this at Thanksgiving.